What's up, guys? So today I did work out, but I just got too lazy in filming it because I was listening to this podcast and I was just like, screw it. So you just have to take my word for it. I really did work out. It wasn't a great workout. I can admit that, but I did try to get in the gains because all I do is gain weight and it ain't pretty thing. And I got to represent y'all to the best of my ability. But anyway, uh, so it's uh, Daddy Sunday, I guess. So we took out Theodore. Theodore came with me. Uh, we're, we just finished our meeting here at SDMI, so you guys saw happy how happy he was making all the ladies, which is what he does. Huh, Theo? Theo! Uh, he don't care. Um, so yeah, now I'm on my way to uh, my next client, Las Vegas Heels. Gotta sit down with them real quick for a nini. And so I'll be back. <laughs> All right, so we just got done with Las Vegas Heels. If you don't know what Las Vegas Heels is, basically Las Vegas Heels is an organization here in Las Vegas that they hold a mixer with all of the hospitals and doctors here in Las Vegas. And then I met the guy that runs the whole thing, Mr. Doug Geisner, uh, about five years ago. And since then, he's hired us for all the gigs for uh, all the healthcare stuff. And there's something that goes on every single month here in Las Vegas. And then the big one that we had to talk about today was the gala. And the gala is at the Four Seasons uh, next to Manly Bay. Huge event, uh, six, seven hundred people go to it, and it's great because I get to eat the food, and it's so good. But anyway, on the important part, it's to recognize the doctors that are making a huge difference. And I've met so many amazing doctors through this program that um, are some of them are going to be some of the speakers at Mobilizing People Live. So if you've ever wondered, like why do you know all these random doctors or random people it's because of uh, this organization because we're the ones that myself and mr kent wong and some of you guys haven't even met uh, our other part of npm which is mr james song uh they putting these videos together that you know gives us so much credibility with the doctors and uh, all that stuff so very very cool so yeah i finished up at steinberg diagnostic with our meeting over there and then i'm going to be filming dr steinberg tomorrow morning and then we just finished up with Las Vegas Heels right now. And now I have to go to the bank, deposit some checks, deposit some money, and then we will continue. And then we're actually filming today something I'm excited about. We're filming the commercial for how to eat your way to a six figure income on the Las Vegas monorail. So you'll see the behind the scenes for that. And then we'll get the main video up for that also. You won't even believe me if you saw that line in Bank of America, 35 people deep. Ain't no one got 30 minutes to wait to deposit checks. That's ridiculous. Oh wait, hold on, something's wrong. What's up guys? So I just got back home and I have great news for everybody that how to eat your way to a six figure income. We officially have our cater for the event. Yuzu Kitchen Kaiseki is going to be giving us the delicious Japanese food that I know every single one of you guys are gonna absolutely love. And don't think just sushi, because I know a lot of people just think it's sushi when it's not that. You're gonna have a nice little taste from Yuzu Kitchen Kaiseki. I'm so excited for you guys to be able to try them at the book signing party on the 27th today. Uh, in a couple hours, me and Kendra are going to meet up over at the SLS monorail station and film the commercial. Really quick, bust that out and get that to you guys. And hopefully you guys can uh, promote and get some people to it if that's your thing. And I will talk to you guys soon.
What's up guys? So me and Ashley, we just got to Ramen Kobu here on Spring Mountain. This is their newest location and it's my beautiful girlfriend's day off on Tuesdays and Wednesdays typically. So we always like to go out. Say hello, Renee. Hi. And so we're trying different foods. Um, this is our, her first time. This is my second time. I went with her cousin for the first time. So we're going to be trying out different foods. The gyoza, the cucumber, the ramen. We're excited. I'm excited. Let's get fat. What's up team? So we're here on the monorail right now. We're making the commercial for how to eat your way to a six figure income. Uh, hopefully you guys like the commercial. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, I'm digging it right now in the way that we're filming it and hopefully it's just a lot of fun. And the restaurant I ate at earlier, Kobo, Ramen Kobo, Spring Mountain and like, not Valley View, yeah Valley View maybe, Spring Mountain, Valley View, Wind Road one of those two but it's next it's in the same street line as uh fuck kim long um and all those other and lee sandwiches so if you liked any of the looks of those foods you know the gyoza is made fresh over there and they do a japanese style that's the way it's supposed to look a little fyi so if you never eat it looking like that then you ain't even eating it and then we had uh the ramen me and ashley split chicken ramen because she don't eat red meat pork or beef and then uh, that was solid, that was pretty good. And then they had some killer garlic sauce that was really, really good. And yeah, today was a good day. We're gonna film this. I'm gonna edit this out. I'm gonna send it to James, see if he thinks that I did a good or bad job. And if he says I did a bad job, then we'll make him do it. But I don't think that this type of video he needs to. Um, yeah, team, I'm excited. You guys are beautiful. And I hope uh, everyone's working hard, getting their customers out of the way so then that way you can reap the benefits of getting paid and let's kick some butt <laughs> Oh, oh, oh.